your ETA. Heading back now. Over. Proceed to 26.133 degrees north, 3.628 degrees east. Got it. invitation. Samantha Beaumont, Global Union Supervisor of the Lunar Licensing Program. We have a lot to discuss, but first I'd like to introduce you to your artificial data amalgamating messenger. Thank you for participating in the Lunar Licensing Program. The program stipulates that your corporation set up operative spaceports to act as bases for a new wave of lunar colonization. You will further assist Global Union in the development of a fusion energy reactor to avert Earth's impending energy crisis. Officially, only mega corporations are allowed in the program, but I personally took a stand for you. You just have to sign in with your corporation name. But I need to see your corporate logo as well, for identification purposes. My superiors at the Global Union had reservations about you, but I've convinced them. They even decided to allocate you high-grade territory for new corporate headquarters. Choose a sector. Almost there. We just have to negotiate the terms of your contract with Global Union, funding conditions, and the like. You are now entering Phase 1 of the Lunar Licensing Program. The Global Union assigned you territory in Earth's temperate region to establish a spaceport and a base of operations. The construction of a space elevator to Global Union Headquarters is also required. For further instructions, speak to your official contact person. Global Union wishes you success. Wide meadows and towering mountains. And soon you will add an impressive skyline to the picture. But stay attentive. I was informed a Big Five company has been monitoring the ruined dam for quite some time now. This could turn out beneficial for you at some point, but your prime objective is to raise a spaceport here. Hello, my friends. This is the Amnu, spaceport building site off the coast is still unstaffed, but as soon as you've built the necessary housing, your construction. Now we shall start to build roads and housing. I know it's a lot of things to keep in mind, but Adam compiled you a database where you can access all the information you need.
And now we shall start to build housing. And then we start by the roads because they need road connections. Otherwise, they'll be don't get any people to live in them. Someone call for some workers. Construction options expanded. I hope this helps you. Misplacing buildings is, will be expensive, but I want it straight and pretty. As you can see, there's, there are symbols on the housings. This looks like roads, that means you are not connected to the road net. And when the road is connected, expanded. the road symbols disappears. Now we shall try to build the materials we need to for building, and that is biopolymers. Great. Building material shortages shouldn't be an issue anymore. For the biopolymers they need sunflower resin resin oil and they need some flowers to produce resin. And the population need to eat and then we start to build a rice farm. is perceived as needless luxury by many megacorps. Good to see you share the union's perspective. Check the um, information box here. You need still need more residents. Give me five more people to live in the houses to complete this. And all other objects is uh, reached here. We build the rice farm. We have built the connect sunflower farm. We Warning. have built the biopolymer factory. Overload. Now you can see we have no energy, and we need to build a wind park. The wind parks need to be connected to the road net as well. Your industry suffers from a shortage of workforce. This impairs productivity. I have some clarifying information for you.
It's all right here, I guess. You know, no. Your construction crew is one of the first ready. Keep up the pace. Your competitors will try to catch up. For the next construction stage, you'll need qualified ground staff to operate the spaceport. Make sure to adhere to union standards while providing the required infrastructure. To clarify what she means, that is that she need, uh, we need to upgrade the buildings so we can have other workers. Warning. Other type of work. Unfulfilled workers. demand for specific consumer products. Okay. Good. Then we're saying you, you keep need this procedure in mind in water. future. There are water. We build it on the shore. And as usual, road connection. this desalination plant. These days it's the only way to come by drinkable water. Very good. We should standardize the process. Corporation value has risen. Construction of new building types possible. Now we need to build an info room as close as possible to the housing. An info room is placed here. Where should we place it? Uh, I think there would be a good place spot to play for it. A broad range of information surfaces. This will enable your employees to develop their interests as well as their... And as you can see, we need um, more energy. We do that by building another one, another wind park. That we need to place so they have most efficiency and we shall not place them like this because they efficient to slow them. Energy demand can no longer be met. And as usual, road connection.
Now we shall try to upgrade the buildings so we can get other sort of employees. New Blue. Remarkable progress. You've assembled construction crews and ground personnel. The program demands you connect your city with the Global Union Space Station via a space elevator. So far, only megacorps like the Big Five use such technology. But I'm sure you have the same potential. Sorry for that. Now we need to start the project on building the space elevator. Next, we need to produce construction bots. And that we need operators for. And that's why we have upgraded the buildings. Then we start to use the mines that is over here. We need both nano ceramics and cobalts. Then we need to place a mine for it. There's two mines close range. One here. And another one here. And as always, road connection. Now they're starting to produce goods. Now we need to build a robot assembly hall. Good. You've gathered the components needed for the elevator. Only the elevator cable requires special materials you can't produce. But I arranged for a delivery. Warning. Energy demand can no longer be met. As you can see, there are only we need energy again. And that's the thing, build another one. Warning. Human resources. Ah, I knew there was something going on here. Nick Papadakis, Papadakis Enterprises. You want a good deal? Just come to my warehouse. There is coming um, like uh, suggestions to do something. You don't need to do them, but it could help you. And as you can see down here, Your there are shortages. From a shortage shortage of workforce. workforce. This impairs as productivity. Said. First, looking of the Anu 22.5, we'll start to build the elevator in the next. Your facilities are consuming more energy than you are providing. Part. This reduces their productivity. Thank you for watching, give the video a thumbs up, share the video and subscribe and I will see you next time, goodbye.